hey loves happy well i was gonna say happy sunday but i think it's gonna be happy monday or happy wednesday when this goes up so we will just play it by ear so two things i want to address before i get into this insanity of visit outfits is first of all my name is ro i'm the founder of strong prison lives and families and i use my years of experience to help prison lives and family members feel educated empowered supported and loved not only while their loved ones are inside but also long after they come home um and today we're doing something for while they are inside i have winter visit outfits so really quick before i get into that because it was a um I did request for some of our members to send their visit outfits because you guys might not like my style. I like my style. Some people like my style. You guys have requested it, so I'm posting it. But for some girls who just want to post up, uh, who want to share their visit outfits, I asked them to send in their outfits and I asked them to send in where um, information on where they got each piece from. And I will, if I get them, I think I got three photos already, I will add them into this video so you guys have other options from different people in different climates, in different locations, at different facilities. So there you go. With different body type and add of that in there. But let's get started. If you are interested in um, future outfits, ideas, inspiration on what is approved, what you are to visit, please keep watching. Okay. I will insert photos of me wearing all these pieces or where I got my inspiration from on Google. I'll put all those photos in as well. But the first one, I got this sweater at Kohl's. It's kind of oversized. It has sleeves. I love this with just a white t-shirt underneath it. I got this at Walmart for $7. And then um, I don't have them out here, but you could just wear it with, if you're allowed to wear to visit black leggings or jeans or black jeans, whatever you want. I wore it with this long, oh, see, good thing we're filming in my room so I could just grab stuff. But I wore this with this um, long, pretty necklace. I got that at Layla Row, but you can, I'm sure, get something similar at Target or Amazon. Um, and I wore them with these adorable slides from Target. I've also seen them at TJ Maxx. I've seen them online. Um, you can get them from Amazon. If you're not allowed to wear a backless, you could wear it with um, a low booty. You could wear it with like a cute little slip on sneaker if you have to wear sneakers. It's just really fun. I wear this a lot to run errands and I will insert a picture. I wore this when I was flying because to the prisoner family conference, even though it was early in October and it was a little bit warmer, I freeze on a plane. So this with leggings underneath was like really comfortable for me. Next outfit is going to be worn with the same um white t-shirt you can get one anywhere this has just like a little bit of cute little um at the neckline just a little bit of detailing and i got that again walmart seven dollars just with a pair of looser fitting um cropped these are not ripped we're not allowed to wear ripped jeans it's just a ripped illusion so you can't see through the holes um here's a trick if you can't wear ripped jeans but i love you love the way that your ripped jeans fit that's a hack. I will make a new video about it, but I've put, um, I, I've sewn in patches or you can sew over them, but I've sewn patches or I've done the iron on patches on the inside so that your skin isn't showing, but you could still wear your ripped jeans. There's a hack I'll do another time. So I do that. And then I wear this, um, this shawl with it. I got this from Kohl's. Um, that's a really cute look because it's just kind of oversized and I was pairing it with these brown booties that I wear very often from TJ Maxx. They are extremely old. They're probably going on 10 years old. So they're, I think, Jessica Simpson brand from, again, TJ Maxx, like 10 years ago, maybe $30, but I kind of need to replace them. I just haven't found a pair that I love as much. Um, so that's a fun outfit. I will, again, insert a picture there. Um, and if you can't wear a scarf or a shawl, I always bring a backup. You could do a cardigan. You could do a little blazer, whatever works for you. Um, or you could just change the shirt and wear just that in a sweater. Because that is similar to the next outfit that I'm going to bring actually as backup. These same um, looser fit cropped, um, they're not boyfriend, they're not girlfriend. It's just kind of like a looser fit jeans. These, I, I don't remember if I said it. I got these from JC Penny. They are Union Bay brand. And they were on sale. I think I got these for seven or eight dollars too off the clearance rack. So I got this sweater. I think it's adorable. I think it's a beautiful little cropped little sweater. I actually have never worn it from TJ Maxx. It's 
Elity brand and it was $16.99 at TJ Maxx. So I was thinking if that doesn't work, if I'm not allowed to wear this, I would just put a little chambray shirt underneath this sweater. You could wear white underneath there as well. You could wear whatever you want underneath there and then pair that with these same jeans and this booty. I actually will wear that to visit, I am sure. The next outfit I am so excited for is um, an outfit that I saw on Google. I wanted to recreate it. So I have been searching all over for this shirt since May or June, okay? So this is a knockoff Gucci t-shirt. I wound up getting it from Etsy. I will link the store below. I literally just got it. It's a little wrinkly because I just washed it because I don't know if you guys wash your clothes before you wear them, but if I don't, then they get I get really stinky for some reason. I have to wash those chemicals off, so my deodorant actually works. I guess the chemicals on there maybe cancel out your de deodorant, as weird as that sounds. So I'm going to wear this. I'm going to recreate this outfit. I will put the picture in with um, a pair of just regular skinny. I thought these were black when I bought them, but they're actually navy blue. And when I bought them, my sister saw them and she goes, I have the exact same pair and I love them to pieces. They're very stretched. They're like more like a jegging, but they have like, it's not like they look like leggings. Like I don't really love jegging jeans that are too, too stretchy and we can't wear leggings to visit, but these should be able to be good. They're from TJ Maxx as well. They are Kenzie brand and they are, they were, I believe 1999. I guess I took the tags off, but I'm going to pair these together um with this chunky oversized knit cardigan that i got from boohoo um all of that together i can't decide if i'm going to wear this is also fall this gucci belt with it it might be too much i'm not sure and then um this is from Rainbow. It's, I'll show you guys when you see the picture because I asked my sister yesterday when we when I bought this. It was $6.99 from Rainbow. And I was like, is this kind of like cheesy looking? And she said, no. When I showed her the picture, that was my inspiration. She said it'll look good all together. You guys can be the judges. And then for this outfit, I'm going to probably wear this booty. Um, but I haven't decided. It might look better with this oh these are from these are from fashion nova last season i believe windsor still has them i believe fashion nova might still have them or these that are brand new from dsw i actually haven't decided if i'm going to keep them they are um what brand is this lucky brand they were a little bit on the expensive side i really like them because they have a thicker um calf part and my calves are so thick that if I find a boot that leaves space between my calf, I like that look between like their space between your skin and the boot. I tend to try to get those because um, I just think they slim out my leg a little bit, but I'm not sure that I absolutely am in love with this boot. I have to try on the outfit and see and see if I'll actually get use out of these before I decide to keep them because they were on the more expensive side. I want to say like 70 or $80 because they were brand new when I got them at DSW. I think they're going to be a return, but I'll let you guys know. Um, so that's that outfit. And then this is, oh, and duh, I wanted to add that you could throw on with this t-shirt outfit, you could just throw on a pair of sneakers. These are Adidas. They are the Edge Lux. I get so many compliments on these. Adidas Bounce Edge Lux. I got these at DSW as well. I've seen them all over the place. I've seen them at the Adidas outlet. Um, they're super cute. I actually want to get them in black, but when I bought these, these were, it was like last year, September, and they were the white, so they were the summer, um, I guess, style, so I got them for 70% off. They had the black ones there. I did not get them because they were full price, and I didn't want to pay full price for them, um, but I thought that would, these could be really cute with the um, Gucci t-shirt, and I do think that the black ones are at the outlets right now and in some stores for cheaper because that's an older model. Model? what do you call it an older style um okay next up would be this one is like really really jersey girl but i love this outfit i wore it to my sister's boyfriend's birthday party last year so it's just a pair of oops a pair of basic jeans these are from kohl's they're a juicy brand um but just a basic pair of whatever your favorite jeans are and then i got this it's velour but it's basically sweatshirt material and it has a really pretty detail on the sleeve um so they're like that big sleeve so it's just literally a velour sweatshirt with jeans and then i want to wear it with 
these black over the knee boots to just kind of dress it up. These are actually a hundred years old. They're from MJM, which is closed down. It's kind of like an older, um, it's like a, it was similar to DSW. I believe that Burlington Coat Factory owned that store, but they shut down. So you can find an over the knee black boot anywhere. Um, and then with these hoops, because it just kind of like, I don't know, it like jerseys up a sweatshirt, like kind of like, um, this is like a really, with my hair like big and curly, hoop earrings, sweatshirt, skinny jeans and over the knee boots. That's like really like a very specific look. So don't make fun of me if you think it's trashy, but I sometimes like that look. Okay, sometimes I like to look trashy. That doesn't make any sense, but you guys know what I mean. I bought these boots at Forever 21 for $30, I think, when my sister told me that they looked like Chanel they're a Chanel knockoff and then I bought them and then I'm like what am I gonna wear with them so I think what I decided to wear with these booties I had to make the outfit around the shoes either like a really pretty dress would be gorgeous with these but I'm not gonna mess around with that for a visit because it's freezing where I go and I need to be covered up so I think what I'm gonna do is wear these dark navy jeans with This, it's a mock turtleneck sweater that, sorry about the glare, with these really pretty sleeves. I'm okay to wear these to visit. I don't know if you guys can wear that sheer. I wore it there once, I was okay. Um, so the, these jeans, shirt, with this booty just to dress it up. I think that'd be really pretty. With, see, I love navy and black together. Some people don't. Or if you don't like the black, you could wear it with just a white sweater. So white, oops, it's backwards and inside out. It's a long sweater, um, again, with those jeans. Any dark jean and this booty would be really pretty. This sweater is from Forever 21, it was $15. Um, okay, and I think we're up to our last outfit. This is my favorite, favorite, favorite. Okay, so I just got hangers attached. You notice these blazers are like all the rage right now. So I got this blazer, just the blazer. This, this shirt is underneath there. I got this blazer from TJ Maxx for on clearance for $15. However, if you like this look, this blazer, this plaid that's in right now, it's, it's not really transferring on camera, but there's a red um, stripe that goes through inside of this plaid. I saw this everywhere. Walmart had it for $24. Rainbow had it yesterday for around $12 on clearance. This I got at TJ Maxx, which is hit or miss, but it was on clearance for, what did I just say? $15, originally $19.99. Um, and they had a whole bunch there, so I don't know if your TJ Maxx's have the same. I know it's different everywhere. But I love how it has this little sleeve that looks like it gets pushed up. So I'm thinking about wearing it two different ways. I mean, you can wear it so many different ways, but I would wear it with this just little red t-shirt and some skinny jeans or you can do that like loose boyfriend jean look that would look really pretty with a black booty um or i'm thinking i will put the picture in i found this yesterday i got these as a steal with a white t-shirt or something like a t-shirt a cami or something underneath with a skinny jean and hold please my favorite part of today's haul are these this sock boot ah, you will never believe where i got these i never shopped there my sister sent me a 40 percent off coupon pay less i paid 20 dollars for these 26 dollars for these something like that can you see the um the detail on these it's a really pretty sock boot. I almost didn't get them, and my sister talked me into it because she's like, they're so much off. So I think that's going to be my next visit outfit. Um, oh, and I also forgot, you guys. Dropping earrings on the floor. I also forgot I got these at Payless for $6. I forgot about them because I'm not going to be able to wear these for so too much longer, but I'll be able to wear these in the spring. So these were from Payless for $6, originally $24 or $29.99 on clearance right now. They were $11, but everything is 40% off. 
I think through this week, I apologize if this is too late, but go there, grab them because this would be really cute with just a pair of like a um, medium wash, like this color wash, where'd those jeans go? Like this color wash jean with um, like a lighter colored sweater. My sister knots hers right here and she wears them with those shoes. And I was like, I need that outfit. It is so adorable. So I'm gonna go try on everything, take pictures for you, insert them in here. And then if this is not too long, I will insert our members pictures and what they wear and where they get their stuff from for different style for you guys. Or I will make that um, part two of this video. So if you guys have visit outfits that you love and you want to share them and you don't even have to put your face. You could just either put pictures of the pieces. You can take a picture and and put something over your face. You could take a picture of just your body, not your face. You could take a picture and put like an emoji over your face, anything you want, but we would love to see your outfits too. Let us know where you got stuff from and you could help our members as well. As always, if you want to shop my closet, the link is below. I'll put it in the cards. Um, you can follow my Poshmark link. Also, I will put in the cards my fall visit outfit videos, visit outfit of the day, of the weekend, whatever video, so tongue tied, because um, first of all, that's still in style right now, it's still fall, and second of all, for you guys that are in warmer climates where it hasn't gone full blown winter yet for you guys, um, then there will be stuff inspiration for you there as well we have a pinterest board that admin cat i believe created for visit outfits as well so if you don't follow us on pinterest go follow us there at strong prism lives i believe it's linked below if cat sends me that link i will post it in the cards as well um and i believe that is it so say it with me you guys keep staying strong keep loving strong keep supporting one another through this journey because you're one day closer to all being behind you lots of love from my heart to yours i will see you guys in the next video but until then make sure you still stay cute stay on style stay on trend and show us your visit outfit of the day video visit outfit of the day photos i'm a mess today um and if you want shop our poshmark closet all of the extra proceeds go directly to spwf the nonprofit, and that's something else if you guys want to help support the nonprofit, it is not free for me to run it i have to pay maintenance fees we have to pay um for the platforms that we use for zoom we have to pay for the programs that we were developing and implementing um so if you find it out of the kindness of your heart you are we would be so 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 grateful if you just um click that button and shoot us over whatever you find it in your heart to donate to the nonprofit. We are a 501c C3 charity that is completely tax deductible. I need to just go because I can't talk anymore. Love you guys.